Hello friends, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at Sonic World DX. How to install and run the game on your PC. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to sonicworldfangame.com. That'll drop you off on the home page. After accessing the home page, you'll want to go to the downloads page. Once that loads, you'll be downloading version 1 of Sonic World DX. This is the latest version. You don't need the 2020 demo or the anniversary demo. You'll be ignoring Sonic World releases 1 through 10. You'll want version 1. This will take you to a Google Drive link where you'll be able to download the .rar file. If that does not work and the link is down, you'll want to click the Discord link. Once you click the Discord link, you agree to join the server. If you don't have a Discord account, please make one. Because the rest of this guide requires you to have a Discord account. So once you drop into the Discord, you'll be here on the rules. So please read all of the rules, go over them, and then accept the rules by reacting to Carlbot by clicking one of these things right down here, these emojis, specifically the check mark. Once you've done that, you're going to want to go to Sonic World DX downloads, and here you have alternative download links for the game. You'll ignore the first post right here. Okay. You'll scroll up. You'll have a mega mirror and a OneDrive mirror. These are alternative links to download the game. Once you download the game, you're going to click on Sonic World DX hot patches. Here, you're going to see patch 1.2.7. You'll download this .rar file. After downloading, you'll open up your file explorer and go to your download section. Here you will find Sonic World DX 1.2.4 and patch 1.2.7. The instructions for extracting them are right clicking and pressing extract all. So here I've extracted patch 1.2.7. I have another program for extracting files. If you don't have this ability in your Windows install or if you are on Linux, you extract it similarly to a .tar.gz program. Okay, but if you're on Windows and you are not able to right click and extract something, you can go to 7zip.org, download the .exe. Then you go back to the file. You right click properties and change from opens with file explorer or nothing you might say find in Windows store. You'll change that to the 7zip file manager that you just downloaded. So in my case, I'm going to be extracting Sonic World DX with 7-Zip in the 4-Video folder here. So I'm going to drag and drop, and it's going to extract. This may take a minute, as the file is quite large. So I'm going to go ahead and open the Sonic World DX 1.2.4 folder. Okay, so we have the game here, but we have another step we have to do. I'm going to go back to my downloads, patch 1.2.7, I'm going to open it twice. I'm going to left click in this blank area, drag, then let go, right click, and I'm going to press the scissors, which is the cut option in Windows. Once I've cut the files, I'm going to go back to Sonic World DX 1.2.4 and right click in a blank area and press this clipboard. The clipboard lets you paste a file. Here it's going to ask you to replace 148 files with the same name. You're going to say yes, replace the files in the destination. Once that is complete, you can tr you can try running the game. Okay. The game may load a single stage and then when you exit and reopen the game, you'll get an error that says memory access violation. If this does happen to you and you're not able to continue playing the game, you may want to go back to the Discord, go to Sonic World DX support. It's under the Sonic World DX tab below general. <laughs> okay, once you get here, you'll see this top post 
fix for MAV in the character select or loading any model dash DG Voodoo 2. You'll click this and scroll all the way to the bottom if it's not already there. So there's so many messages. And you'll see here I've posted DG Voodoo underscore pass through dot zip DG Voodoo underscore emulated dot zip DG Voodoo Vulcan pass through dot zip Vulcan emulated dot zip alt pass through dot zip alt emulated dot zip for your use case and 90% of users you'll download DG Voodoo pass through dot zip it's 1.86 megabytes you'll go to your downloads folder and here it is I'm going to right click extract all press next wait for it to extract open the folder and then I will grab I'm going to left click dock hold the shift key and then left click d3 d8 then I'm going to press the scissors once again at the top left or you can right click and press the scissors we're going to go to Sonic World DX 1.2.4 right click a blank area and press clipboard which is paste that'll put all of these files in here afterwards you should be able to run the game and play it when you run the game for the first time windows will say it's protected your pc using microsoft defender smart screen because this is an unrecognized app that is not verified through the windows store it does not actually put your pc at risk to run this file so what you'll do is press more info and run anyway this file has been screened on multiple websites that scan for viruses it is completely clean and safe to use once you get into the game for the first time your controller will not work if you have a controller you're going to want to use your keyboard choose your settings i'm going to play on high and then i'm going to go down and press controller now your controller should work if you have a DualShock PlayStation controller or a Nintendo Switch controller off-brand or legitimate, you will need to use an, a third-party program for your controller to work. You should now be able to play any stage in Sonic World DX. If you have any further issues, feel free to at me using the at symbol on your keyboard by pressing shift two and then typing slipping stones in the Sonic World DX support thread. There are niche use cases where DG Voodoo pass through may not work for you. If that happens, please let me know and I can direct you to the proper files so that you're able to enjoy this fantastic game just like everyone else in the server. If your controller isn't working, please add me as well, and I will direct you to guides that we have created in the Sonic World DX server so that you're able to get your controller working for the game. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Not my best effort.